What's up, guys? Flu700 here with a review for Inu X Boku SS. Now, I'm going to be doing a quick character introduction. I promise I won't take too long on this, so just, you know, bear with me. Ravicio, who is the girl in the picture, main female protagonist, has a very sharp tongue thanks to um, a hard childhood, and she hides her true feelings. As far as, uh, you know, she tries to act all big and tough, but she's really not. Uh, Mikitsukami, who is the bodyguard to Ravichio, he pretty much adores her and has no purpose without her. She, um, well, I won't, yeah. I'll, I'll mention this part in the uh, story, because there's a big part about him. Natsume, he is, for Fran he is friends with uh, Kagoru and Mikitsukami, He's an oddball, very, um, like a flamboyant person. Kingero is Ravichio's arranged fiancé. He made Mikitsukami write her letters pretending to be him, so he didn't really have to bother. Um, like, that's the part of the, what I wanted to say about Mikitsukami. He actually wrote letters to Ravichio pretending to be Kagoro, because Kagoro didn't want to be bothered with having to write Ravichio. Um... They didn't really see a lot of each other, so. Uh, and then there is Soren Ozuka, Ravichio's childhood friend, and he acts as her big brother. Now, there are some other characters in this um, that I'm not really going to mention. I mean, don't get me wrong, they're cool characters. They're just not really, like, the biggest portion of it. I mean, they are important, just not, um, I don't know. I picked up the characters that I think left the greatest impact. As far as animation goes, I thought the animation was great because the um, bloodline they share, where they have to teleport or uh, transform into their um, like different forms. I can't remember what it's called. I really hate that, but um, I thought that was an awesome thing because yeah, they have like a bloodline um, in this anime, and they will transform into these different um, creatures. And it's very, uh, I don't know, it's very interesting and very, well, they're not really creatures, they're, like, just different forms, um, I don't really know how to describe it. Like, Vermicchio transforms into this, like, ram, I think it's a ram, and, uh, has a scythe, or not like a, no, it's not a scythe, it isn't a scythe, it's like a, I can't remember what they call it, I see them in anime, but I just can't remember. Um, there is also, uh, Mikitsukami who transforms into a fox, and it's very, I don't know, the whole anime had great animation. The story, story was great. I thought, you know, it lacked a few, um, it lacked, uh, like, action. But it's not really an action anime. It's more of just Ravicio. Ravicio moves out of her, um, you know, house and, uh, with, you know, like, family, like, the family house type of thing. Uh, moves into a place with, uh, where there's only these type of people living there, their kind, and... She starts anew. She is 16 years old when she does this. Mikisukami is hired as her bodyguard. Everyone in the building has a bodyguard. Um, and just overall, oh, it's such a great like storyline and like the romance between Ravichio and Mikisukami is really interesting because like he's like all for her and she's kind of resists him at first and she's all you know sharp tongue and whatnot and he like worships the ground at her feet and everything like that. So story one, story wise, 9.4. And the overall rating for this anime is a 9.5. Now I really adored this anime. I thought it was a great one. One of my favorites on the top of the list. Definitely deserves a 9.5. Definitely not disappointing. So yeah guys, if you guys want like some romance going on, pick this. It's great for that. Um... It's right up there with Eat a Kiss. I mean, it's not like, it's not the same as Eat a Kiss, obviously, but, you know, it has, it has some awesome, um, uh, romance in there, and it has some awesome, like, there are some action scenes that are really cool. Animation's great, of course, like I said, and just overall, this is a great anime. You guys deserve to watch it. So, anyway, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share my video. It helps me out as a small YouTuber, and I'll catch all you guys later. Peace.